Hey there, fellow vagabonds. Are you tired of travel blogs that paint everything with sunshine and rainbows? Yeah, me too. This channel is for the real deal. The honest adventures, the unexpected detours, the budgeting hacks that actually work. Because let's face it, the best journeys are the ones that surprise you. I'm Carter, and I'm here to show you how to travel the world on your terms, have a blast doing it, and most importantly, live your best life as a wandering soul. So buckle up, vagabonds, it's time to explore. Hey everyone, wanna skip the Eiffel Tower and explore a city with some real flavor? We're heading to Lisbon, Portugal, baby. This city is old school awesome. Has food to die for and enough hills to make your legs scream. But don't worry, adventurers, because I've got the ultimate Lisbon top 10 to make your Portuguese trip epic. So grab your pastel donata and let's go. Imagine San Francisco's cable cars, but way steeper. Just hang on tight and hope you don't get tangled in someone's laundry. But forget the crowds that you find at Tram 28. It's a tourist trap. Lisbon has a whole network of trams each with its quirky charm. For example, Tram 15E takes you through the historic Alphama district, but instead of the tourist hotspots, it winds through hidden alleyways and past charming laundry draped balconies. It's like stepping back in time. You get a real feel for the local life away from the selfie sticks. Exploring Lisbon by tram is a fun and affordable adventure. You never know what hidden gems you'll discover. Skip the tourist tramps and hop on a less crowded tram. You might find a little slice of Lisbon magic. If you want to pretend that you are a knight and explore this awesome fortress, do it. Just don't get lost in the maze-like alleys up to Sal George Castle, unless you want to become the king of accidental naps. First things first, this castle sits on a mighty hill. You've got three options. Saddle up your walking boots, snag a ride on the 737 bus, or for the truly adventurous, conquer the tram tracks with Tram 28. But be warned, it gets crowded faster than a royal feast. This castle has seen its fair share of battles, and the walls themselves whisper stories. Look for informative plaques and hidden corners you might just stumble upon a secret passage or forgotten well. The castle walls offer panoramic vistas of Lisbon that would make any king envious. Take a moment to soak it all in, from the terracotta rooftops of Alfama to the sparkling Tagus River. If you took transportation up to Sao George Castle, consider walking down and getting lost. Alfama is Lisbon's confusing heart. It's full of hidden gems and enough turns to make you go dizzy. But hey, at least you can pop into a cafe and be lost with a pastel de nada in hand. It's the most delicious custard tart ever. And as long as you are walking downward, you'll eventually make it towards the river. The cheapest way to get out to the Blime District is to take the 15 tram. It's a super busy tram, but it has two cars on it and it'll get you out there on the cheapest way possible. Otherwise, you will need to take a Uber and it'll be a little more expensive. The one you are in the Blime District, you want to check out the Blime Tower. This cool building is basically a giant stone hello to the ocean. Take a selfie with it, then hit the nearby beach to relax. Ocean breeze not included, you gotta bring your own. But before you leave the Blime District, you must see the Geronimos Monastery. It's an amazing building that is a must-see. But seriously, that name is a tongue twister. Maybe practice saying it a few times before you go, or just point and smile. The Geronimos Monastery wasn't built solely for religious purposes. It also served as a monument to Portugal's golden age of exploration. Look closely at the intricate carvings throughout the monastery. You will see nautical motifs, exotic plants, and animals brought back from the voyages and even symbols referencing famous explorers like Vasco da Gama. It's a fascinating way to learn about 
Portugal's rich history and discovery without needing a history book. Immerse yourself in Fado, Portugal's music that is kind of sad. It's guaranteed to make you think about life or how much you miss your pet. Tissues are not included. Seriously though, this is a great way to experience Portuguese culture in the Barrio Alto district. There's plenty of Fado bars where you can enjoy a drink and a bite to eat. However, the Barrio Alto has more than Fado. Pop in, enjoy some Fado around 7, and then later on in the night, enjoy Lisbon's legendary nightlife. Hit up the Barrio Alto for cool bars, live music, and enough sangria to make you forget your flight home. However, before you fly back home, you're going to want to check out the Tile Museum. Portugal loves these beautiful tiles, and this museum is their Hall of Fame. Prepare to be amazed by the incredible designs that will make your bathrooms look boring. Lisbon's say is like a trip through time, all rolled into one fantastic building. This mighty church isn't just a pretty face. Well, it is pretty. It's tough as nails, too. Imagine thick walls and lookout points, like a real-life castle. But don't worry, no dragons guard the door. Although, with the history, maybe there should be. Inside, it's a whole different story. Beautiful stained glass windows, cast colorful light, cool carvings tell stories on the walls, and there's enough gold to make your eyes pop. It's like stepping into a history book, but way cooler. So if you're looking for a place with adventure, amazing art, and a hefty dose of history, then the Lisbon Say Cathedral is your jam. Just outside of the city center, you can find the LX Factory. It is a great place to find a place to eat, and it is a hipster haven. This old factory area is now a haven for trendy shops, cafes, and art galleries. It's perfect for picking up unique souvenirs or that funny mustache you've always wanted. So there you have it, Bank Bonds, your Lisbon top 10 list. Lisbon's a city that will surprise you. It'll work your legs. It'll fill your belly with delicious food. For more funny travel temps and off the beaten path adventures, subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. Safe travels and remember, being different is awesome.